I don't know how it's going to go. Y'all know how RP goes. But the plan for today is to either run gold mines <clears throat> or um, or just to go and do the uh, and, and try to get some materials for the little office spot that uh, that we had picked out. So we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Um, it depends. The gold mines, I kind of don't want to run them. If I don't have a whole lot of people around because it's dangerous, you know, so I have a pin. There we go. Uh, I need some food, man. I need to eat. I need to eat. I need to eat. Dang, the sun's bright. Ugh. Morning. Good morning. Holy shit, I thought that was a glare from the sun. It, it just happens to be a pink horse. Oh, yes. Nice horse, isn't it? I mean, it's... it's. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. a good word for it, I suppose. I just was typing. <laughs> How are you? I'm Huck Weller. Nice to meet you, Huck. I'm Jeremiah. Oh. I'm sorry, he's what? He's here. He's here. Yeah. My name is Jeremiah. Huck, come here. Tre no, wait, wait, ho, oh, oh, ho, oh, oh, hold on. Am I seeing a ghost? Sound like that. Uh. He rode up on a horse named Pink. A pink horse on a ghost. Now look. I've seen some paranormal shit before, but this is unbelievable. Didn't you get shot on my front in my front yard? Oh Whoa. shit! Get the hell out of here now! Oh. Get off my land now, you bastard! Huck, I came come to here now! Pace. Huck, come here now! Oh, I'm I'm coming! I'm coming! Now hurry! I'm coming! Just keep the gun down! Son of a! Bitch, get off my land! I'll shoot your fucking ass! Go help her and tell her not to shoot at me next time. I'm I'm going help her. Just uh just <laughs> Motherfuck. I'm coming in. Kimber, come, come on. You need a doctor. You believe me. I ain't you scared need... of that son of a bitch. You need then to come get back the out. fuck off my land. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> son of a bitch. I came to off a piece. You just made a fatal Oh, fuck mistake. if you did. You've been shooting innocent people for fucking days. You aren't offering fucking peace. How do you expect us to fucking believe you? You've been Go shooting the people Remington. around this community for fucking Go days. Go and ask Remington. Well. You're lucky I'm trying to turn over a new leaf. Or I would have just walked up and put a fucking bow in your mouth. Be back later to speak with someone uh, more civil. I am the one you're going to be speaking to, asshole. You've been hurting people for days. How do you expect us to react to you? That's Honestly. Fine. You can respect like that, but this we will be back. This is crazy. This is crazy. You signed your own grave. <laughs> Wake up to a gunfight yelling, We are in war. Kimber, you need a doctor. You you do need a doctor. Hey, is GG awake yet? <clears throat> I I don't know. I just woke up myself. I haven't had a chance to to see who's awake or who not who's not. And I shot up in the air any damn way and told him to get off the land. I didn't shoot him. Oh God. Hello. Anyone awake? Oh, come in. 
Kimber's in a bad way. She just got shot. Um, get a get a bandage. Let me take a bandage. Get a bandage. Maybe that'll help. How uh, how how bad I'm are tired you of wounded? My people getting hurt. How bad I'm are you? I'm tired wounded? of my friends getting hurt. I honestly couldn't tell you, Huck. I'm I'm seeing red. Let's put it that way. All right. It's adrenaline, I bet. When did this all this happen? Just now, thirty Jeremiah seconds ago. Just here. I he thought that fellow was, was dead. Pete. He said he was can here to you, make peace. Huck, uh, uh, can somebody look and get me some meat out of the cooker? Out of the cooker. Yeah. And yep, I shot yep, up yep. in the air, so it was a warning shot. I told him to get off the land and shot up in the air. So, and then he comes back and he shoots me. I didn't aim at him. Hell, I couldn't even see him. Barely. I saw the ass end of his pink horse. Cameo, open the door. <laughs> How about another bandage? Would that help? I'm not bleeding anymore, honey. It's okay. okay. I just got to recover now. All right. All right. Yeah, I don't know why he'd come back. I shot up in the air with my, because I was on the corner of the house. All I saw was the little right hind quarter of his pink horse. I didn't even see him. So, yeah, I shot up in the air and told him to get the fuck off our land. But that's my right. Yeah. I'm allowed to do that. Yeah, to get him off really our land. Of course you are. Yeah. Of course you are. Knowing that he's been hurting our friends, like Huck and JJ and, and all the folks around here, that that's, it's just ridiculous. So You're bring right. your ass back, you son of a bitch. If you think I'm going to deal with your fucking bullshit, you are crazy. You are not going to hurt my fucking people anymore. So the only way I could say it is, is Huck's in disbelief because he can't believe Damn, what he just saw. Because he was trying he to find out up. how he was alive. Because he was, you know. I apologize, Huck. No, you know I'm I'm still in dis. I'm I'm glad you're okay, but I'm still in disbelief. I I saw him die in my front yard, and that's what I was trying I, to I find out. Did. But when he gave his name and Huck is standing out there in the yard with him, all I could think was we need to get Huck safe. So I go out the kitchen door and stand at the side of the house and shoot up in the air and tell that bastard to get off of our land so that Huck could get to safety. And how the hell does somebody who died come standing back in front of you in flesh? I don't How the know. hell does that happen? Right. I don't know. And he that's, didn't that's, he didn't shoot me. Yeah. He told me to go help you is what he told me after you went down. So I, I really don't know what his aim was. I'm furious right now. I am shaking like a leaf. Furious. I am so sick to death of this. We're peaceable people. We're fair-minded people. We don't need this kind of garbage. Good people getting hurt and threatened every damn day. And I'm not putting up with it out here anymore. I'm just not. I refuse to. I absolutely refuse to. I hear you. I do. Xavier's going to be so damn mad at me. He's going to be so pissed off. I told you he simmers. I explode. There's a big difference well. between my brother and I. But I am tired of my people getting hurt. I am tired of the people that I care about getting hurt. I'm done with it. I and know, I didn't shoot I that bastard. The I could have, but was, I shot no. up in the air and told him to get the hell no, off the land. Guys. Son of a bitch. Time for a posse. I'm pissed off right sorry. now. I'm sorry. I am so sorry it's for okay. my language, y'all. I am mad you, as hell right now. Don't you worry about it. Just breathe. Please, just breathe. <laughs> oh man. I think you need to lay down on the sofa. Yeah, you or, need to relax. I'm gonna get my goat. You need to relax. I'm gonna get my goat and I'm gonna sit down. Okay. This is bullshit. I'm not gonna have my friends getting hurt. She just picked up the couch. How did she <laughs> <laughs> the way that things break down, you you need a you need a drink or something. Do you have one? I'm, I I I don't I don't know what I got. Tell you the truth, let me see. There might be some <laughs> tea or something in there. I don't have anything. My water jar's empty. Okay, let oh, me get you some tea. She's broke up, IRL. She's broke up, IRL. 
uh, I know this might be inappropriate, but I got some some of that strange cake they serve over there at the fish. It'll numb you up. <laughs> I'll be okay. All right. I'm I'm getting better. I'm just pissed off right now. I'm just pissed. I'm tired of my people getting hurt, Huck. I know it, baby. Listen, you gotta calm down. I, you know, I truly believe. I, I, Xavier I mean, is gonna kill me, y'all. He's gonna be so no, mad at me. No, I mean, he's gonna be mad. When he don't gets you on, he's your brother. Don't relax, you worry relax. About it. You did what you felt was right, and it was the heat of the moment and all, you know. <laughs> Any of the pot cake yet? That's what I had. But I, I, I don't know what to think about it, y'all. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm flabbergasted at the moment because I literally saw the man that, that was shot in my front yard revived, and he did not shoot me. He actually told me to help you. So I don't, I don't know what his aim is, you know. I mean, I, I, I just don't know I, what I to did think. Hear him. I, well, I yes, did but hear then he did just say I... that I signed my death warrant, so I guess he's pissed off at me. But I didn't hit him. I shot up in the air. Yeah. Right. Well, he, he might have not known your intentions. I, you know, when I first got to Gunsmoke County, every daggum time I heard a bullet sing out, I thought I thought my life was in jeopardy. And and I come to realize that a lot of folks shoot for different reasons. Uh, if he if he viewed you as a threat, I mean, he's going to defend any man, regardless if they in law or outlaw will shoot back. You know, if he thought he was being fired yes, at. Yes, that's true. <clears throat> but I'm not going to shoot any man in the back. I shot up in the air from the side of the house. I couldn't even see him. Well, I saw the right hind quarter of his horse. Because, God, how could you miss it? Right. <laughs> that is true. <clears throat> well, listen, if you're going to be all right, I, I have some affairs that I must attend to. Um I slept here last night out of safety. Oh, of course. That fella didn't try to shoot me. I don't believe he's going to try to shoot me again. Hell, if he does approach me, maybe I could find out what's going on and, and, and offer some sort of resolution. I I ain't much. I ain't no gunfighter, so I can't Absolutely. offer that, you know, but uh, I could see what I could do. At any okay. rate, let's, uh, I'm, Absolutely, I'm, Huck. listen, you take care of yourself, all right? You take care of yourself too, Huck, and yes, I mean that. Yes, ma'am, I will. I just wanted to get you to safety. That's all Be I was careful. thinking about. I appreciate you. Yes, ma'am. All right. See you soon. Oh, hey, can somebody let Cookie out of this uh this kennel here? Yep, I'll be right there. All right. I'll be quick. <laughs> Good morning, Gunsmoke. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Take care, Huck. Be Will careful. do. Y'all be careful as well. Okay. <laughs> Holy crap, man. Ah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh man talk about some shit fish in the bucket looks clean What did you miss? Oh, we just woke up to a gunfight. We just woke up to a gunfight. Uh. <laughs> Action from the very get-go. Ladies and gentlemen, you cannot make this shit up. <laughs> Huck is it like he's shrouded in a cloud of, <laughs> of constant conflict, man. If it ain't fucking... If it ain't... If it ain't bandits, it's dead bandits. Or ghosts, or the ghost of bandits. He don't even know no more. Wits end, he's gonna crack. <laughs> he's gonna crack. <laughs> this is the kind of day that Huck just wants to go in his house, slide under his covers and eat some of that marijuana cake, man. <laughs> just fucking read a good ghost story. 
something that he could at least, something that he at least is interested in understanding, you know? Blaze up the carrot cake to relate the stress. <laughs> right? Oh my god. Ah, home sweet home. Oh, there's a pink horse right there. Oh my. Pink horse right there. <clears throat> it might still happen. It might be another pink horse though. It's kind of a call sign right now, isn't it? Yeah, that butter. Hey. How you doing? Uh, I don't mean any harm now. I'm just here to talk. <laughs> I need to put your hands. Oh well, I mean. Yeah, come on, come on over. All come right. over. All right, all right. Hold on here and get my wits together. If you want to draw a gun, don't worry. No, I'll no, myself. no, no, no. I'm I'm unarmed. I'm unarmed. <clears throat> Smart folk put all their shit away nowadays before they go traveling with, with uh, well, I don't know if to call you a guy or a ghost or what. <clears throat> I feel like a fucking ghost because I feel half dead. Well, I, I imagine you should. Uh, Jeremiah, I'm, like I was telling you, I, I've seen some strange shit. But my partner Tavian dragged you in the lake, man. We 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 could have swore you were dead. I mean, I ain't no doctor, but I... I've seen wait, dead wait, wait. people. You saw what happened that night. I'm uh, way well, I did. Yeah, I was I was in the front yard. I kind of instigated it to tell you the truth. Don't shoot me. I'm just I'm just speaking the truth. At least truth. you're honest. No, um, I appreciate the honesty. So, I mean, every, every all the things in the paper and everything that everybody had been saying that you were you were shooting up people and um well, you were speaking with Liz and I didn't know that if she knew that you were sinister or not, so I I brought it to her attention. But the woman just back. Wait, no, who, who, Arthur's who, wife, Miss Way. The one who lives here. Yeah, 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 that's, yeah, that's yeah, right. That's right. They got kicked out of Greywater a while back. See, Arthur and I uh, were friends, and and Arthur. I know they did. I robbed the their bank earlier today. Oh my, well. Do you have to tell me shit? An eye for an eye. I'm trying not to be nervous here and kind of talk to you about things. You can't just start describing crazy shit that you do. I'm 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 not comfortable with all this outlaw stuff, man. I ain't trying to conspire with criminals. I'm just trying to figure out what the hell's oh, no. going well, on. Oh no, well go. See, that's the thing. I was screaming at your friend to go to Remington for a reason. And the town up there. Basically, after that little wound, I've realized I I am not a mortal. If I ever get hit like that again, I ain't wake up. I am not a young man. It is a God-given miracle that a doctor found me in the water. It is a fucking miracle. I can't ride too long. I can barely swim. I can't even use a rifle anymore. My entire right side of my body is fucked. So you I say... I can barely feel my hand. A, doc a doctor rescued you? Yeah, and now they work for me. Oh, wow. Well, that would explain. So I it made then. that doctor a little deal. Right. I made a little deal with the doctor. We'd continue our banditry ways without trying to harm folk. We'd offer an alternative. So for a homestead, five dollars a week. Bird, you put a red flag outside. None of us will fuck with you. There's another group of bandits going around here called the Dark Knight Riders or something. We are currently trying to deal with that issue more than anything. I'd actually come to offer one the protection and two. Ask if they knew where these bandits were. Well, in 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 Kimber's defense, I mean, a bandit is a bandit, and in my eyes, it was too. Fully. And, and and I mean, her friends got shot. They they got a lot of bloodshed in that town recently, and I mean, she. Oh, I do not they expect on high to be alert, forgiven. Man. They on high alert. She she told me that she fired a warning shot, which I believe because the pellets almost hit me. I had to duck. She said she saw the ass end of your horse and she just wanted you to get out. And she's mad as hell, man. And I I, I can't say a blamer. I don't know why. I I'm can so understand calm. why. I can understand. <clears throat> Put it this way, yeah. Uh, if you if you, but I don't know what happened that night. I don't know. I'm pretty free. I'm I'm a quite arrogant man. 
If I was gonna rob you or harm you, you'd know I was gonna do it. Right. Well, they they don't know that. The same way that you didn't know she wasn't firing at you when that gun went off, and and I can exactly see how that you have to assume too. and act. <clears throat> right, right, exactly. Well, I could tell you this. But no, uh, I'm not. I'm not. I'm. I, I can't. I can't be. I can't be affiliated with law law breaking criminals and 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 all that. But I could tell you that I don't want to see anybody else get hurt, especially from that old town. They've done so much for me. Um, and I don't know what I could do. You said you made a deal with a doctor before, and I don't want to put you. I don't want to put you on my payroll by any means. Hell, after I got robbed the other day, I don't have much <laughs> shit left. Um, but, but wait, who robbed you? I mean, I, I I I suppose you did. Is is what folks are telling me? I got shot the other day. Okay, I don't remember. So this, shit. this is the misconception. A lot <laughs> of people have been robbed around this area, and I've been getting the blame. Don't get me wrong, I've robbed a lot of people. But there's a very big distinction. These people wear orange bandanas. That is a very specific trait of this group of bandits. They wear orange bandanas. Not red, orange. I never wear a bandana. I got if you, you see an orange bandana, I have, like, don't get me wrong, I shoot rather quickly. But these people, from what I have heard, you don't hear a word before the bullet hits you in the back of the head. They tried it with me earlier. I had two people try and rob me with orange bandanas. Fortunately, they picked the wrong person to try and rob. Right. Well, I know from experience that yeah, you're a pretty good shot. <clears throat> but that's the thing. I took one of them over to a sheriff, handed him over, and I'm hoping he gets home. At the end of the day, yeah, I'm going to continue my robbing spree. I don't want to murder no folk. I don't want to hurt no folk. Everyone has a living to make. But these bandits, they're not in it for the money. They're in it literally to shoot. You go over to a remnant and you ask. I went over there with a good offer. And we even haggled it down. They gave me a crate of whiskey and $10 a week. That's all I want. And they have my protection. Because the law ain't going to help them. Well, ain't, there ain't no law around here right now, unfortunately. Exactly. So I'm taking it into my own hands. The way I see it, don't get me wrong, I'm a thief. But, uh, you know, this is our area to rob from and extort would be the better word. Now, these people want to take everything. We just want a measly little payment a week. You have to understand... Yeah. Whether lesser of two evils. Well, I don't, I don't, I don't know. That like, I can't see. I don't know what I could offer you. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't rightly pay you for protection. I mean, uh, if if no, if, that's fine. If people you're covered under there, Remington. Right. Oh. Wait. The flag. Literally, you'll see every town covered by us has a red flag in the center. Covers a really wide radius around it. From Remington all the way to the town, just on that hill there, completely protected. If anyone in a red bandana stops you and claims they're from my group, just tell them you paid your tax and they should just let you go. Well, how... From Remington, though, so how... What, my question to you, think, think about this from my perspective. How in the world are you supposed to be an honorable guy as, as a law-abiding citizen if, if you're actually paying criminals, hey, no matter what the value is, I'm not questioning oh, yeah. the value, oh, yes. hell, you know, but, I mean, <laughs> it just seems, that just seems so wrong in my eyes. I mean, I'm a moral guy. <laughs> Dark Knight, thank you for yeah, the bits. Yeah, but that's the thing. Morals don't, put it this way, yeah. Say you didn't pay us. Yeah, it's the immoral thing to do. So what, you're just going to take your chances with every, everyone who comes by? Howdy, people. Howdy there. Hi there. I believe you're the man who just came from Remington, right? Since you have the pink horse and all. And that's me. Can I, ask, can I ask you why? Why did I come from Remington, or...? No, w why are you doing this to people in general? There's no point into it. You're just doing endless bloodshed for no reason. You're saying bloodshed? I ain't shot no one recently. And the ways I have, I've made sure they're fine after. I think you're mistaking me for someone else. Nah, you're a bandit, I think. I'm a bandit, but there's more than one black. group of bandits. Hey, but you're red and black, just like, was it the Knight Riders, Knight Fellows? We are not like the Knight Riders, the Dark Riders, whatever the fuck they're called. All right, hold on. They wear hold orange on, bandanas. Hold Do on. not confuse us. Let's, let's all gather our wits and keep our voices. There ain't nobody needs to, to get angry right now. We all just having a peaceful civil discussion among men. Well, civil. 
Apologies. We were just talking about morals, if you'd like to join us. I don't think it's anyone. I'm just pointing out the wrongs in your way of earning money. Just me, gentlemen. You damage just me. people and make them pay for money that they don't have since you just took it from them and I have to do my job for free because you shot that man who's... Hmm. Look, obviously you have an issue with it, so why don't you come into the light where I can actually see you and we can talk like men. If I was going to shoot you, I would have, so don't worry about angering me. Fucking hell. Plan get off my horse. I'm sorry, my friend. I must leave soon, but I'm just pointing out the wrongs you have done. I have done many wrongs, and I am well aware of them. <laughs> right. you know, I'm trying to make amends the way I know how. Sheriffs are coming and haunting you town, my friend. Your entire group is wanted. I know they everybody, are wanted. Uh... Everybody in White Willow to, to Juniper want to kill all of you. Yeah, I don't see either of you drawing a gun. No. Not yet. So I'm a man of some sort of and decency. Now, I'm not going to shoot a man who's... You can't eye. just talk willy-nilly about threats, man. Just let's keep this civil. We're, we're all speaking right now. You say you're not going to draw well, a gun yet, you're going to get when shot. They just shot three men at a birthday party. Because huh? I ain't no goddamn gunfighter. Do I look they, like you're a sitting gunfighter to you? It. Let me clear one thing up. <laughs> they had orange bandanas, or some people took it. There were five members in our bandana. core group. They were not ours. I had heard about it this morning while up north. No, 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 no. Maria. The hook's not gonna be I was told anybody. a gun party was shot up. I was asleep. So ominous. <laughs> the rain Anyone who knows me knows I will stuff. gloat about my crimes, but that was not me. Or any of what any, anyone affiliated with. And I didn't We're trying it. to stop that. That's mindless bloodshed. That is mindless. At least we want the money. At least we have some, even if it is a shitty motive, at least we have a motive. They do not. They are bloodthirsty. Alright. To uh, have a good conversation, I need to. Uh... Head home to Remington and do a few things. Have a good day. Well, at least, yeah, at least y'all exchange is civilized, civilized salutations, I suppose. Who y'all make me nervous exactly, as that's... hell, man? How do you? How do? You, listen, this is gonna come out of nowhere. But how the fuck do you settle your stomach when all this shit's going down? I just took a, a shit mid conversation, Jeremiah. Just now. You wanna be you wanna be honest? You wanna be honest? Yeah. Every yeah. time I see a gun drawn, I shit myself. I shit and piss myself. Well how how do you do it? <laughs> because it's the only way we know how to make living things. Well man, I can teach you a whole Unfortunately you have to remember to make money. I'm we don't like easy. shooting at people. We just that's the thing. We just want a little cut of what people want. Even if it's twenty five percent when we hold them up. They have Sorry, one second. Adult diapers is how. <sighs> Shitting and shooting, that's how I trade. <laughs> the good, the bad, and the ugly. Oh, thank goodness, the rain. Was Sorry, I, I was uh, in deep form. No, it's it, it's quite all right. I'm 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 still wrestling with keeping my guts together. See, that's the thing. Like, people are accusing us of shooting up a birthday party. That's not me. When we stop folks, they can give us... They could give us anything. It's just the fault of them actually, you know, running a little bit. They don't have to give us everything, but they then run or draw a gun. And you have to remember, the second they draw a gun, our lives are in danger. we got to defend ourselves. Yeah, we put ourselves in that position. It's the position we choose to put ourselves in. They choose to draw a gun on armed people. Well... I mean, you can't blame them, though. I mean, they're just trying to protect what's theirs. I, I did the same thing. Oh, you know? fully. I can understand that. But at the same time, if you have not only one trained gunsman, but there was four of us earlier all together. There were four of us, and you were one man. Are you going to draw a gun? And these people are all infamous as well. They're oh, taking absolutely out sheriffs. Not. They're taking out people left and right. Yeah, absolutely not. I mean... They choose to get shot at that point. Right. I had a young... Uh, 
foreign man try and shoot me with a bow and arrow earlier. That was just comical. <laughs> Wait, I'm sorry, what? <laughs> there were four of us, all pointed guns at him, so he decided he'd take a pot shot at me with a bow and arrow, trying to take me out. Oh, my. Well, that's Unfortunately, he missed. That's so we got him down, bandaged him, bandaged his friends, and told him to be on their way. I carry bandages for other people because I don't like. I I don't want to. I don't want to badly wound someone. Mm. What needs to be done needs to be done in my eyes. But well, Jeremiah, you can't like you 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 play you play in both sides of the fence here. You can't be a hero and and a criminal all at one time. People, I'm people not just a hero. don't know that. Well, no, I'm exaggerating. What oh, I'm saying okay. is, I mean. Everybody's just going. You stereotype now, my friend. Even even if you were, well, look at me now. I'm making small talk with you. I'm I'm just trying to say you're stereotype now. A bandit is a bandit in 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 law abiding folks' eyes. Everybody's scared. And hey, oh, I know when that. I got here, I didn't know how to react to shit. I was I was I was every gunshot. I was scared. You know, I'd, I'd hear a gunshot ringing out the rest. Thought I hit the dirt. Uh, I mean, I just don't know how. How are you going to deliver this kind of message that people around here are safe and how to dis differentiate yourself? And what about copycats and such? If all that separates you because from those bad guys... Because our plan for the Dark Riders. We've already been in talk with three sheriffs. We're going to catch the Dark Riders, drag them to these towns, and they're going to be executed. So you mean to say only you, you're working with the sheriffs now? We have a contact who reaches out to uh, law enforcement, yes. And they come and relay it to us. And there's drop boxes in Ju Jupiter we use for messages. So they ain't trying to hang you? I mean, some law folk are, but the ones we got, they understand what we're doing. And yeah, we're the lesser of two evils. They try and arrest us. They'd never have the chance. Usually we're traveling a big group now. So they're picking the lesser of two evils by allowing those who want money to continue for the time being. And those, you know, who are just out for blood, they're being hunted. Who better to hunt an outlaw than another outlaw? Well, I, I, I couldn't agree more. But, I mean, well, this changes things, though, Jeremiah. If y'all are working with the law, people like Kimber can understand that. They can wrap their head around it. But they're going to need somebody with more credibility than you just telling to them, especially on their land. They're going to shoot, man. And that's uh, that's why I'm not sitting there preaching it until they're all hanging. Once they're all hanging, then I'll preach it. Well, I, I I tell you this. I'm gonna try to deliver a message if if you got one when you were trying to talk earlier. What what do you want me to tell him? And I I can't promise that I'll I'll be able to convince him because she's mad as hell, man. You know how women get. The same offer I gave Remington, considering it's a big area. Each one covers a big area. For homesteads, five dollars a head. Once a week, insurance covered. We won't bother you. No one else should bother you. If they do, we will go and kill them. So paid bounty hunters, $5 a head is what you're saying. Think of it more as insurance. That's the best way to put it. Insurance. All right. Well, I'll, I'll let them know what it is. Um, other... I did have a message sent down there. I have messengers. I pay to deliver messages. Oh, that, right. that is actually the typical response. I've been shot at six times today. Well, I mean, <laughs> I could, I could see how. <laughs> Extortion. I know, huh? Well, until this happens, how do I guarantee you don't shoot me or my friends? There's, there's, there's a gal you over know, there. Might have everyone else wears me. a mask because they actually have normal. Look. Anyhow, I do have to be off. All right. <laughs> Stay safe. Hey, I, I, I'll try. And next time, can you all try and avoid throwing me in the water? I couldn't swim very well beforehand. Now I just can't swim. Well, I, hopefully there won't be a next time, Jeremiah. You say this all willy-nilly. I'm still sure. I, I'm, I am very sure someone's going to try that luck. Even if they don't shoot me first, just push me in the water. I am a terrible swimmer. Well, and this horse has to go through water. I'm sitting there clinging to it, shitting myself. Like, well, oh you, god! Oh, you bet, you better if you want to say. I don't, I don't see how you scared of water over and you take gunfire every day. That's 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 <laughs> I, that I don't quite wrap my head. A around gunshot that, but... you can hear and see coming towards you. The bottom of a lake you can't see. Right, I guess I can understand that.
Anywho, stay safe. Yeah, I, I'll, I'll try. Go speak to the folks at Remington. Other than that, other than the person just passed by, they should have some uh, nice words to say. All right. Well, can't see a lake. I think you said can't see the bottom of the lake. All right. So, we didn't make friendly with the guy. We didn't offer any deals, for sure. This is a huge moral issue for Hook. Like, if they're working with sheriffs... I was trying to get him to say that he was sort of a bounty hunter because that would have made sense. Even though he has a bad reputation, that would have made sense. Insurance is a very bad word, you know? I'm not going to tell the story any differently than I heard it, though. I'm just the messenger, you know? He didn't shoot at me before is the whole reason why Hook didn't think that he would get shot again, you know? So fear of fear of death and all that stuff. 